is Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 3 of season 2 of Run and Girlfriends. Just got to get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Alright, let's see how the fuck this goes. <laughs> oh, God. The one time I just went to skip the opening. <laughs> Yeah. Did he really just? Uh, oh my god! Don't don't do this to me! Don't do this! This is week three. I am trying to hang on. Well, she has nowhere else to go, duh. So yeah, you let her take the bed, you sleep on the floor. See, that's what I was thinking last week.
At least help her. Please don't fall. <gasps> At least like her legs. <laughs> Move. <laughs> At this time of night. It's mommy. <laughs> yeah, especially because you're here. <laughs> There's no way the door's unlocked. Are you Oh my god. Please hurry. Their shoes, though. <sighs> Thank God. 
the night though not have to be with him. You don't need to be with him. You shouldn't want to be with him. <laughs> yeah, but she saw your bag though, Jesus. Where are you going to stay for the night, though? You never even wanted to even reach out to your dad, but I get it.
Cousin. <laughs> I know, because the way he's saying it is almost like a marriage proposal. But, I mean... <laughs> At least he's really genuine and 100% sure about this. But I feel like something is about it is so going to mess this up.
gonna run into mommy though, right? Damn, I was for sure that, like, they would bump into each other. He'd freak the fuck out. And I'd be like, so, anything you want to tell me? But then she would have been like, oh, hi. well, no. He he would have exposed her, been like, so why the fuck were you at my house? But then he would have been, she would have been like, well, how did you know I was at your apartment last night? Huh? Huh? So, of course, she's going to make it her little secret. And then, of course, she's going to blackmail once again. She's a do. But I, I digress. It was a little slow paced in the couple first minutes of the episode, but it was good. I mean, once again, I still don't know how to feel about Kazu because one minute I'm like, yeah, boy. And then the next minute I'm like, I I just want to shake my head and just be like, let me, let me just go. Let me, let me stop and such. He, he's still a, hmm. different type of character let's say that yeah and and it's not different in a bad way it's different in a good way some of his decisions um i don't agree with but i digress that's his character so it's okay all i care about is the best girls that's it that's it yep Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, i do love the fact that he is hold on No, you're imagining that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You really are. You're just a boy in love or really a man in love. Which is? Maybe because, you know, deep, deep, deep down, she kind of cares for you. Nah, she gonna keep that to herself for a good little minute. Now, if she completely, like, mmm, blackmails him, oh no. Or even tells Ruka. show oh, the feels like it's, you know what it's like this it's like this I, I mean okay going back to how I what before I got interrupted I do like the fact that like Kazu was like he he's really genuine on how he feels 
about Chizuru. And we're seeing that. We've seen that ever since the beginning of this start of the second season. But he's really, like, in his heart, he's like, the girl who I want to be with is her. I don't want to be with any other girl, no matter what. It's Chizuru or no one. It, it's just, it, yeah. It's either Chizuru or it's his hand for the night. <laughs> Unfortunately for him. But, um, of course, Chizuru... Chizuru is a very, like, kind of one-sided character where she still has her guard up and everything. And even with her finally opening up about her family and especially her parents, it was very interesting in today's episode. But at the same time, you know, this is a gig for her. I, I don't... There are moments where she kind of maybe feels some type of way towards him. But, um, she still also possibly in maybe her inner monologues or points where we don't really get to see her. Um, she's questioning that herself, of course, because I mean, you know, when you are hanging out with a guy or you're hanging out with a girl, it's chill at first. And then you start maybe, depending on how your mindset goes, um, you start questioning a little things you want to know because you're curious. You're like, hey, you know, what are we? Are we still just friends? Are we something else? Like, let a chick know. But now that mommy knows about the purse and everything. Once again, I feel like she is going to wait the right time. She is playing puppet master right now. She is waiting for all the chips to lie wherever they may so that she can be the baddest bitch that she is and just strike because that's what she does. This is Aoi fucking Yuki, for Christ's sake. She about to strike and like... A damn eagle. She about to swoop on in and just eat it. And then she's about to go and be like, you know what? Fuck you, Kaze. <laughs> just fuck you. Because, I mean, I get it. Like, I completely understand where she's like, I do want to be with him because of the fact is, you know, she's a new. She's jealous of her. But at the same time, it's like, mommy, you, you didn't want him. You barely wanted to be in that relationship with him when you were together. And now because somebody else is in the picture, now you want him off of yourself. Oh, baby, I, I I love her so much. I do, mommy. Best freaking girl, in my opinion. Sorry. But move on from him. I'm just saying from girl to girl, move the fuck on. Like, it, it's, there. there's like, it, it's not, I'm not saying that like Kazu has like emotional baggage. He, he kind of is a baggage type thing in their relationship and such. But it was completely, to me, in my opinion, that relationship between those two was one-sided. She was toying with him the whole entire time. She really didn't give a shit about him. She didn't starting. She didn't start to give a shit about Kazu up until she's a new. Duh. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction to towards episode three of season two of Rent a Girlfriend. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially all on Friday. If not on Friday, probably either Saturday or Sunday for episode four. Yeah, episode four. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because, you know, we about to go into hell week. And I'm about to be busy every single freaking day this week with all the other things that I got to do, plus work as well. And... Yeah, but until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye.